So first thing you need to do is log into TechLine Connect. Now, whenever you're doing um, this updating and programming or first programming uh, or setting up of tech to win you definitely need to make sure that you don't have an MDI plugged in. So no vehicle connected, no MDI plugged in. You're going to go to additional tools and click on tech to win Now, what will happen is you'll get this to pop up. From here, just click quick start and it's going to automatically load tech to win with this box. Now it says your lease is expired or does not exist. From here, you just gotta click okay on there. Now, where it's asking you to connect a device, so this would be like for your MDI or MDI2, just click cancel. You do not, if, if there's, maybe you're working in a shop and multiple MDIs are popping up with other people using, just make sure you do not connect any any MDIs. So click cancel from there. And you wanna let your tech two or tech two win to load to the boot screen. So it should just load up to the boot screen. There we go, or the home screen, whatever you want to call it. Now it says here, default software. Please obtain the newest version from Tech2 software download. And then it says software version 15.100. Now, this shows me right now that I have installed Tech2 Win on the computer, but I've never updated it or put any of the newest software packages in it. And the other thing is down here, it says zero. So that means there's zero days of use in the lease. So first of all, we need to set the this tech two up so that it has the most current software on it. And then once we do that, you'll see that the actual lease days um, basically renew. So how we do that is over here, you go to support. And because we need to actually update the software, we need to go to software download. All right. So we need to make sure that it says tech two is selected and we're gonna click on custom, hit next. And it's going to connect to the tech two and the tech two screen over here, you'll see start to blink. So right now the computer's connecting to this hypothetically, you know, or hypothetical tech two physical one in our hands, but it's actually just an emulator on the computer. Okay, so now we're connected to the tech two and we need to select what we want to use or what we're gonna be setting this up for. North American operations right there. Not North American operations engineering, just North American operations. And I'm gonna go the most current software. This is the last one they made. And the, from what I understand, they will not be releasing anymore. I'm gonna select my language, which is English and click download. So now you can see the screen again has changed on the tech two and it's going to upload the newest software onto the tech two win. Once the update is done, it should show 32 point, whatever it was, 32.04, there it is, okay, at the bottom. And this should then say complete once it's fully done. And you also notice, okay, so 33.004, and we now have 30 days on our lease. And the old checkered flag. Now we can hit close on there. And what I would recommend doing is restarting Tech2 or Tech2 Win before you try to use it because you need to still connect to an MBI and such. So close that. Go over here, additional tools, Tech2 Win, quick start, and there we go. There was no more warning um, pop up box saying, you know, lease is expired, etc. Uh, if an MDI was here, we could click connect. I don't have one on a vehicle, so we're just gonna click cancel. But it should still load up. You can see we have 29 days left of our lease. And it should say 33.004 at the bottom. There we go. Now, one thing though is you do not need to go in and set the software up every time you want to use a Tech 2. So you open this up, it's all there, it's all working, but your lease stays run out. So now you're at zero days, it says your lease is run out, but the software version is still 33.004. You don't need to renew the software every time. If it's just your lease, what you need to do is open up the Tech2 in the same way, just hit you know cancel and just get to this, this home screen. So get to the home screen, click on support, but this time click on security. Okay, so now instead of having to do update your software, 
All you have to do is click on security. Again, make sure the tech two is set up on the home screen. Click next. It's going to look for the tech two. You'll see the screen start to flash again. And then it will start doing its security update, basically renewing the lease. And there we go. So security access granted, finish. Okay, close that. Yes, and you can see on the tech two over here, it says 30 at the bottom. So that just kind of shows you how to update the software. And then also if your tech two lease runs out, how to update or how to renew your lease through TLC. Okay, I hope this was helpful.